po viewers. And there you are. We are now live on Facebook. So, um, are you ready, guys? Ready? I know. <laughs> so, the Facebook notification has already um, entered my phone, meaning we are now live on Facebook. Good afternoon, dear RWC community. Good afternoon, RWC family. Um, this is your center directress. This is Teacher Ayi. And this afternoon, we'll be having our, what, fifth Free trial class. Yes. And of course, I am here today with my partner. This is Teacher, yes. are you there? <laughs> yes, I'm here. Yeah. My name is Teacher Bongi. So I'm sure na ready na kayo sa gagawin nating uh, free class ng RWC Read, Write, and Count Online Tutorials. All right, Teacher. Uh, I would like to... Um, I would like to... Here, our kids for this afternoon. Let's just have a short uh, interview because our viewers uh, haven't seen them yet on our classes. Uh, I think majority of our students today, this is their first time having their um, live stream with us. Okay, let's have first our... Okay, sige teacher, ikaw na pumili. Sige na unang interview natin. <laughs> let's have uh, Summer and Jana. Oh, okay. Summer and Jana. Okay. Hi. Hello, girls. Hello, Summer. Hello. Okay. Summer and Jana. Okay. Summer is actually our student under the program uh, Reading Readiness and Early Years Math. Uh, she's under your section, teacher. All right. Ate, how are you today? I cannot hear you. How are you? How are you? Okay. All right. Ate, would you like to introduce your friend to us? <laughs> Who are you with today? Ate Jana. Hi, Ate Jana. Ate Jana, how old are you? Eight. Eight. All right. So, same with Jemsen. Same with Jemsen. All right. So, Ate Jana, welcome to RWC. I hope, uh, we hope that you'll enjoy our session for this afternoon. Next teacher. Next oh. on the list. Um, teachers, uh, please, uh, you slide. Uh, all right. Okay. I'll try to um, share. I'll be sharing my slide now. Okay, there you are. <laughs> so, for, so today, for today, we will have, we will have our, yes, we will have our fifth free trial class uh, entitled Healthy Eating Habits. And we are your teachers. My name is Teacher Bongi, and with my partner, uh, teacher, I yes. <laughs> okay, teacher. Before I before I go to the next slide, uh, I know that our Facebook community is already with us. They are watching uh, this live stream. We are now live on Facebook, and after we uh, after we finished having this live stream, this video will also be uploaded on our YouTube account. Yeah, we yes, have that's this channel. Correct, exactly. Do you know that, kids? Do you like that? Yes, Sheldon is very uh, active today. Okay. That's why Teacher Ai and Teacher Bongi dropped our um, social media platforms for our Facebook account. Kindly like and follow at Read Right Count 2021 so that you'll be able to watch, share, and... Um, like this video, this live stream. Later, if this video will be uploaded on Facebook, I mean on YouTube, you can find this video in our official YouTube channel, Read Write Count Tutorial Center. Would that be okay with you kids? 
Yes! My goodness! Oh, teacher! Your student is here na pala! Who's that? Ah! Hello, Miles! Good afternoon! Hello. Okay, wow. Ang saya naman nito. Okay, teacher. So, since we have already uh, gave them these um, reminders, would you please, uh, could you please give us what are the activities that we'll have today? Okay, so for today's activities, everyone, please listen. Number one, we will have a discussion about healthy eating habits. This subject is science and language. And... Our teacher for that subject is teacher I. Okay, and after that, uh, and after the discussion about healthy eating habits, uh, now the second one is my plate art activity. So we will have our art activity that what we call uh, pointillism. Are you familiar with pointillism? Yeah, so that will be the, uh, the next art that we are going to do about pointillism. Okay, so the materials that we need for that art is we need, um, of course, watercolor. We need watercolor. We need um, Q-tip like this. We need a Q-tip and we need pencil and marker. And okay. aside from pencil and marker, of course, we need our sketch pad or band paper. Wow. Or watercolor band paper. And of course, we need water. Okay. All right. So I'm sure that you are all excited in our art activity. And next, and the last one, um, we will have our uh, offered programs here in RWC. So what are the subjects that we can teach uh, to your children? And that's it. Okay, teacher. Thank you for that. So I, I bet our kids are really excited for this afternoon. Imagine having a trial class with three subjects in one session. <laughs> All right. Yes, it's only here in our center that we can do that. We can have science, language, and art at the same time. Do you like that, kids? Yes, I know. All right. So please prepare these materials before we start our program. Okay. So what should we have next, teacher? Okay. Next one. For our activity, for, before we start our activity, uh, let's have first our welcome song. Oh, it's our welcome song. Please open your microphones. We're going to sing. All right, we're going to sing the seven days or the days of the week by the singing walrus. Are you ready, kids? Yes. Yes. Okay. Sheldon is very active. Okay, here we are. Hi kids, here is a fun song to help you learn the days of the week. Gavin. Mother ah. Hen is going to sing it for us. Let's listen. Monday, Monday Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, 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 Friday. Wow. Now, very repeat after Mother Hen. Here we go. Monday, Monday Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday, 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 Friday, 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 Saturday, Sunday, 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 Let's sing it quietly. Quietly. Monday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, 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 Sunday,
Share ko lang. Mga students natin for today. Yeah? So, right. what are the seven days of the week? Sunday, yeah. Monday, Tuesday. What's next? Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday. Wednesday. Next. Thursday. Very good. Thursday. Thursday. Friday. 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 Saturday. Okay. Saturday. Next Sunday. Sunday. And then Sunday again. <laughs> All right. What day it is today? Can you tell us what day it is today? Saturday. Saturday. Very good. Saturday. All right. <laughs> Saturday. It's Saturday today. All right. That's why we are having our trial class for today. Imagine our kids are just we just asked them to sing and some of them i mean majority of them aside from singing they also danced very good <laughs> they are all active all right you can today for the first part of our lesson i would like to ask everyone or yeah i would like to ask everyone whenever you see Yes, signal. What can you see on our slide? Eyes on me, eyes, eyes on me, you? eyes on you. Oh, what does it mean? Yeah, eyes on me, eyes on you. Here in our center, we always say this, okay? Eyes on me, When the, whenever your teacher says eyes on me, what should you answer? Eyes on you. you. Very good. Excellent work. All right, let's do it again. Let's do it. Let's say that your teacher will say, Eyes on me. Eyes on you. you. Very good. Eyes on you. I love it. I love this crowd, teacher. <laughs> okay. So, eyes on me, eyes on you. Aside from that, there's another, um, there's another command that we use here in our center. Give me your... What's that, teacher? Listening Yes. Listening ears and eyes. Looking eyes. Okay, I'm going to say eyes on me, eyes on you. I mean, I'm going to say eyes on me. You answer eyes on you. Then teacher Bongi will say, give me your listening ears. Ears and looking eyes. Okay, let's do it, children. Ready? Are you ready? Yes. Uh, yes. Okay, all right. And eyes on me. I on you. Give me your listening ears. Where's your ears? Right here. And your looking eyes. Looking Very eyes. Good. Good job. Very good. Okay, excellent work. All right. So you've already you already know what these commands. Today, I'm gonna ask you today. I feel or today, how do you feel? Let's ask. I'm gonna ask. Hmm, Davin first, or Davin? Davin. Davin, all right. Davin, how do you feel today? Happy. Oh, happy. How about Tisha? Happy too. Happy too, all right. How about, I'm going to ask the girls first. Jensen, how do you feel today? Happy. <laughs> Happy also. How about Summer and Jana? How do you feel, guys? 
Okay. Happy. How about summer? Why? Sleepy. That's sleepy. Okay. Ah, oh, sleepy. so. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> summer. It's oh. sleepy. Okay. All right. How about? Hmm. I'm gonna ask Miles. Miles, how do you feel today? Hungry. 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 Okay. How about Sheldon? I want to ask Sheldon. How do you feel today, Sheldon? Of course, happy. happy. <laughs> so Sheldon is, has been uh, so happy for the entire session. All right. Okay, let's check the weather, guys. Let's check the weather. Here in my place, it's kind of cloudy. It's kind of cloudy and it's about to rain here in my place in Kaloocan City. Teacher is in Kaloocan City. Teacher, how about there in your place? Uh, here in Quezon City, it's um, cloudy too. Cloudy then. Oh, okay. How about let's let's ask Jemson because Jemson is in Bulacan. Uh, ate. What's how about the weather? Cloudy po. Cloudy then. Oh. How about there in your place, Kisha? In our place is cloudy. Cloudy then. Oh, it's how about the rain? Oh, it's almost... Oh, okay. Sige. How about in Sheldon's place? Talagang titignan niya sa bintana. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how's the weather today, Sheldon? Cloudy then? It's cloudy outside. Oh, okay. Mm-mm. Mm, four, four miles. Because miles is just near my home. I think we have the same weather. Naman, it's also cloudy. How about summer and Jana? How's your weather there in your place? Sunny, sunny. Sunny. All right. How about Davin? The weather today in my place is cloudy, as most of the classmates and you two te teachers. Yeah, we have the same. <laughs> so majority of our participants today, the weather in our place is cloudy and it's almost rainy too. Okay, so that's that's a great thing to know. We kind of have the same weather. All right, I'm going to ask you kids, what's on my screen? Potato chips. Mm. Potato <laughs> chips? Oh. Potato chips. Tige, yeah. you open chips. your microphone. Yeah, chips. Okay, potato chips. 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 Okay. Do you eat chips? Be honest. Not that much. Not that much. Not that Not always. How about, yeah, how about Kisha? I eat chips too. Ah, you eat chips too. Sige, kumakain ng chips. Everybody does. All right. Next picture. What's what this? Is That's a donut. Donut. Oh, That's a donut. donut. <laughs> With sprinkles. Oh, I With... love donuts. Oh my goodness. Oh, you love donuts. <laughs> Everybody you does. I love it too. Yeah. That's that's but one of his favorite and donuts are not healthy. <laughs> yes. Oh, really? Okay, we'll find out later. Next, what is this? <gasps> hot dogs. Hot, hot dogs. Hot dogs or hot dogs on buns. Hot hot, hot dog, dog sandwich. Uh, hot dogs on buns or hot dogs on a cob. Correct. Mm. All right. Do you eat this food? Uh, I think not that much. Not. not I think that... not all the time. Oh, not all the time. All right. Next. Hmm, what's this? French fries? Are those French fries? Yes. French fries. I, yeah, I want to ask, I want to ask Summer. Summer, do you eat fries? Yes. <laughs> How about Jana? 
Yes. How about Jensen? Sometimes. Sometimes. How about Sheldon? Yes. Okay, talaga. Two thumbs up pa siya, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Kisha, do you eat fries? Little. A little. Okay, Miles. How about fries? Kumakain ka ng fries? Yes. Okay. Would you like to ask your teachers? <laughs> oh, you ask us. <laughs> you ask us. Teacher? Teacher, do you How like fries? Kit, teacher? <laughs> do you eat fries? <laughs> well, sometimes we eat french fries. Yeah, sometimes. Everybody's guilty with this. This is a guilty pleasure, okay? Well, for oh me, my... I... I... I think I like that. Fries for every McDonald's and Jolly <laughs> Neal. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm so sorry, McDonald's and Jolly Bee. We, we mentioned your name, but nevertheless, thank you for that, Davin. Okay. <laughs> my goodness, teacher Ayi. <laughs> oh, that is what you call a very guiltiness food. What's this? What do you call this? Chocolate! Chocolate bar! Oh, chocolate, I chocolate bar! Oh, everybody's going crazy. <laughs> All right. So, everybody knows this food. I mean, everybody knows all of these foods that I've, yes. showed, uh, that I've shown to you. All right. And also, yeah. everybody also just likes all of those food. Correct. Uh. That's that's true. That's true. I agree with you, Davin. Everybody likes, I mean, all of us, you know, all of us likes this, uh, like these sweets. set of foods. Yeah. Yes, like sweets, but even though that, that we, that we, eat, we feel like we just want to eat them all the time, yes. uh, it's also actually still not healthy. Very good observation. Thank you for that. All right. Let me tell you something, okay? I want to show you a picture of this boy. I want you to look at this picture, all right? Okay. I'm going to ask a student from, for, from our class. I want to know, what can you say about this boy? Anong masasabi niyo sa batang ito? I'm going to ask um, Miles. Oh, he is strong. Okay. I think teacher Keisha raised her hand. Yes. Am I correct? Yes. yes. Okay. Okay, Keisha, what can you say about this boy? He's eating healthy foods. All right. Very good. He's eating healthy foods. Okay. Yes, Jem? He's eating healthy foods. That's why he's strong. Very good. Okay. So... Don't worry for those for the other kids. I I I still have another picture. Very good. All of those um, answers are correct. This boy is strong. This boy eats healthy foods. That's why he is strong. Healthy. Okay. He just keeps yes, on and eating a lot of healthy foods. Very good. Yeah. How about the next picture? Okay, Davin. What can you say about this boy? Uh, he's eating. Uh, that boy is eating lots of very savory looking and non non healthy looking foods. Okay, yeah. thank you for that. So yeah, that's, that's, why that's he, a great. He looks a little over uh big and uh and uh and stout. Okay. Yes, and okay. Also, I wanna ask. I wanna ask Summer. Ate. What is he holding in his hand? What is this? That is a soda or cola. Oh, all right. Hmm. Atijana, what do you think is this boy doing while he is eating? Anong ginagawa niya habang kumakain? He is watching watching TV. Oh, okay. I'm going to ask you kids. Do you think this is a healthy practice while while eating lots of these foods then you're just sitting around like a couch potato? 
<laughs> is that healthy? No. 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 All this right. Is unhealthy. This is unhealthy. If this is unhealthy, can you give him thumbs down? Thumbs down. Thumbs down. Yes, because this is unhealthy practice. All right. So before we go to the next activity, I'm going to give you this story. Do you want some story time? Yes. Yes. Please. yes. Okay, story time. Let, uh, just give me a few seconds. I need to switch to my to my book. Okay. And there you are. Okay, so we're going to have a story today, and the title of our story is, what's the title of our story? The that, little, little Kids, kids table. table. All huh, right, huh. The Little Kids Table. Okay, before, before I uh, proceed to my story, I would like to request everybody to please turn off or put your microphones on mute so that your, te your teacher will be able to read the entire story properly. All right. Thank you so much, everybody. So my story for Nobody today is... Nobody could hear the sound. Okay. The Little, the little Kids Table, written by Mary Ann McCabe Riel, and illustrated by Mary Reed Hughes. Again, this is The Little Kids Table. All right. I love when we visit my grandma Mabel. I get to sit at the little kid's table. The grown-up's table is so shiny and fancy and has pretty flowers from my aunt Nancy. <laughs> Look at their table. When my grandma calls out, let's eat. Like in musical chairs, we race for our seats. We run super fast. We're almost flying, but my brother gets bumped and ends up crying. <laughs> oh no. Next to our forks, we have spoons at our places we try to get them to stick to our faces first you breathe on the spoon then press it on tight it'll hang from your nose if you do it just right <laughs> look at this girl <laughs> okay can you see my laser pointer <laughs> All right, what is she doing with the spoon? She is balancing <laughs> the spoon with her yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you. Mom piles food high on all our plates, making us try the foods we know we'll hate. Hmm, I have no idea why it's my mom's goal to have us all love broccoli casserole. <gasps> broccoli casserole. Look at this. Oh, do you eat broccoli? Thumbs up if you eat broccoli. All right, very good. Look at these kids. They, they, they don't like to eat that food. <laughs> all right. Because even if you are not very picky, there are some foods that are totally icky. That's true. Grandma says, you might like it. You never know. If you don't eat your, your veggies, how will you grow? <laughs> Is she correct? If you don't eat your veggies, how will you grow? Okay, thank you for that. Yeah, look at them. <laughs> We play tricks at this table. Don't leave your seat. You might come back to a meal you won't want to eat. Still, the broccoli is there. <laughs> Peas in your milk or some messy ketchup grins. Two of the favorites from my cousins, the twins. 
Yes, it does like their dress, putting lots of ketchup on it and also making a very silly face. And also, <laughs> when they're trying to eat it, they put lots and lots of ketchup so that they oh, want so that they might not taste the broccoli. Very good. Correct. Correct observation. They keep on putting lots of ketchup so that they will not taste the broccoli. Why smooth? <laughs> yes, but that means they'll run out of broccoli. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, but uh huh, we get super silly. You know how it that goes. You start laughing so hard, milk squirts from your nose. But before someone chokes on their mac and cheese, mom gives us the look that says, "Stop it now, please." <laughs> all right. But in comes crashing, my grandpa's dog, Daisy, with her jumping and barking, it gets even more crazy. What's the dog's name? Daisy! Daisy, very Daisy. good. Okay. Daisy is the name of the dog. He says she's part lab, another part poodle, and calls her sweet, her, her his sweet little labradoodle because he is labrador and poodle at the same time that's why daisy is a labradoodle okay look at daisy and giggle gulp clatter and munch icky sticky crash and crunch our parents look over and tell us to hush but i think they wish they were still one of us. Because I can see it in Uncle Fred's eyes at the end of the meal when it's time for pie. With a grin on his face, he gives us a wink. He'd rather sit here at least that's what I think. I bet if I if grown-ups were granted three wishes. One would be to give up those fancy dishes and go back to the days when they were able to sit again at the little kids' tables. Because all we know, or we all know, when the meal is done, which of the tables has had the most fun? The end. All right. Okay, so that is my story. What's the title what of my story? A story that was unbelievable. Little kids table. The little kids table. Okay, the little kids table. Hello, Ryan. Welcome. Okay. Yeah, the little kids table. All right. What was that food? What was the food that their mom is trying to give them? Broccoli. Broccoli, okay. Instead of eating broccoli, what did they do with the broccoli? They, they just played. played. They played with the broccoli using the ketchup and making funny faces with oh. it. And just and also for those who are to, who want to who's eating it, they just put lots of lots of ketchup so that they might not taste the broccoli. But that means Very they'll, good. they will have no more ketchup to put on the broccoli for next time's visit. Correct. Yes, that's uh, that's what they were doing with the broccoli. Instead of eating it, they keep on soaking it with the ketchup. All right. Do you, do you think it will it will make sense? Yeah, I think so. It's not. I think not, yeah, yeah, it tastes gross. Yeah? Anyway, you're, anyway, you're frozen. You're frozen. She's frozen. Okay. Oh, I'm frozen, yeah. Oh. Hello, everybody. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's just, just wait for teacher I. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so you're okay. So teacher, I now left the meeting room, and now you're the host, teacher Polly. Okay, so what happened after that? So do you have the same observation with David? Am I correct? David? Yes. Do you have the same observation? Um, how about let's call um Jensen. Hi, Jensen. Okay, so TJ is now here. Oh, Jen, uh, I have a question. Oh, Jensen, do you have the same observation with David? Same, but I'm I know. here. <laughs> mm, the, and teacher I is back again. Yeah, I'm back. Oh, Sorry. I. Yeah, uh, I got. Uh, we got a little power interruption. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's fine. It's all right. So yeah, let's continue. Don't worry. Now. Yeah, don't worry. Our 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 um yeah our meeting is still live on Facebook. It doesn't affect our meeting. Okay. Yes. Well, it well I see you just keep on freezing, and now you're freezing again. Okay. What happened? Okay. So let's continue now, and then after that. Um, what happened to the story? They play their food. Is that well, okay, you guys? Yes. Let's ask Summer. Huh? Uh, David. Uh, uh, let's ask. Let's Summer ask first. Summer first. Oh, Summer. Oh, Summer. Uh, if your mommy uh, prepare you a food, would you play it? Oh, oh, kids, we should we should not do that, okay? Uh, because it's not appropriate to play our food because that's All right. not, okay. Yeah. And teacher I, Ayun, hello yeah, teacher. I'm, you're there. I'm here. I'm there. Seeing. You are. Yeah. Thank you for that, teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. The floor is yours again. It's yes. Your Thank you. Okay. Sorry, you. I, I think uh, there's a problem with with our. Uh, it's not with my internet. It's it's with the power connection. I don't know. Yeah. Am I am am I much clearer now on your screens? Okay. Everybody. Yes. Well, yes. Everybody. Yes. Can, well, go, David. Go, David. Okay. Okay, so I think uh, let's continue now our lesson. Yeah, teacher, can you hear me? Yes, teacher, I hear you. Can you please, everybody, give okay. me thumbs up if we are now ready to start our lesson? Two thumbs up, please. Okay, thank All you. All right. Everyone. Thank you. Thank you so much, teacher. Okay. Can you see what's on my screen? Is it Jar Jar? This a this food, food for me. Oh. Okay, all right. Thank you so much. Okay, so this is a uh, this is a food pyramid. Okay, this is what we were trying to trying to show uh, trying to give you earlier. All right. Okay, as you can see, thank you so much. Okay, I, I, I can now see it. All right, as you can see, this is a food pyramid. That's correct, Keisha, thank you for that. Okay, under this food pyramid, there is a set of food which we call what? Bread and? Bread and cereals. Correct. Well... Bread and cereals. Well, I think mm -hmm. actually the fruits and vegetables are fruits actually and and milk. Okay, can you tell me what are some of the foods inside the bread and cereals group? Carbohydrates. Can you tell me what are these foods like? Is this what food is this? What kind of food is this? A, a bread. Let's call um. Let's give our the floor to Kisha. Hey, Kisha, you're raising your hand. Yeah, Where thank I you. Where I go, foods. 
Yeah, very good. Exactly. Correct. They are. Thank you for the teacher and Tisha. Okay, this is A. We have here bread. We have here cereals and oat. Okay, so those are some of the foods that, uh, yeah, we need to consume under the bread and cereals. All right. Is it much clearer now? Can you hear me, guys? Yes. My, yes. My okay, okay uh, thank you're you. You're frozen, Jesus. All right. Okay, how about this second group? What is this? Fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables. Okay, fruits and vegetables. Okay. What are some of the fruits and vegetables that we have here? Apple. Apple. In our group. Can you tell me? Can you Apple. give me some? Um at the su summer and Jana. Okay. Very good. Correct. All right. There you are. Correct. Thank you. So apples, carrots, uh, this can be uh, lettuce. Um, what else? Bell pepper, strawberry, and orange. Aside from this, teacher, is Sheldon still around? Can you still see Sheldon? Yes. yes. Yeah. Okay, Sheldon, can you give me a fruit, any fruit that you eat? Grapes. Ah, grapes. Okay. Grapes Thank you for that. Wow. Very good. Grapes and <laughs> mango. Okay. Thank you so much. Another food group that we have above this uh, these fruits. What do we have? Milk, cheese, and yogurt. Correct. Milk, cheese, and yogurt. Very well said. Okay. So these are some of the foods also that we should consume as for the fruits and then that's the right amount like milk cheese and yogurt that will give us calcium are you familiar with calcium guys yes yes i'm familiar with that yes what correct what can calcium or what can calcium give to your body what what does it uh contri contribute to your body it helps us strong to have strong stronger what teeth and bones very good Excellent answers. Next, aside from milk, cheese, and yogurt, what's the other food group that we have here? Meat and eggs. Meat and eggs. Very good. Thank you so much. Meat and eggs, correct. So meat, it can be um, chicken, from beef, from or, or beef, or pork, or eggs, yeah. Oh. Okay, so those are, these meat can give us protein. You know protein? Have you heard about protein? Yes, I also heard of protein. Yeah. Very good. Okay, correct. And can you see what's the uppermost part of our pyramid? Sweet. What's the uppermost? Sweet. Sweet. Okay, remember this, children. I'm going to stop sharing for a while so that I can see everybody. All right. Remember this: the smaller, the smaller um, portion, the food is on the pyramid. That's how we should consume that food. Okay. So the biggest portion that we have to consume are those from bread, um, fruits, vegetables, and the smallest portion should be that sweet on the top. Okay. Did you get it? Yes. Yes. So you mean like the oh, smaller the, okay. so, the place is of the pyramid, the less you should eat. the less you should eat. Very good. Correct. Okay, so let's have fill in the basket. I'm gonna need your help, teacher. Um, uh, please help me in calling the students. Okay, so okay, I am so going to call some student, and once that I call your name, uh. 
you uh, turn on your microphone. Okay? Okay. Correct. That's how we do it. So, oh. all right. So, this is a game. This is kind of, uh, this is sort of a game. Mm -hmm. So, I will call your name first and then that's the only time that you, uh, you say to our lesson. Okay. okay. Very good. All right. Okay, number one. Okay, the instruction is which of these foods must be inside the healthy basket? Healthy basket. Okay, let's call they, David. Hello, David. Oh, let's call David first. Okay, you should David. put in the basket the bananas since it's also healthy. Correct. Very good. Very good. Next. Okay. Okay, go teacher. Yeah. Number two. Number two, let's go. Which Jensen. should be on the healthy basket. Thank you. Watermelon. Watermelon. Okay. Do you eat watermelon? Very good. Jensen? What no, what number is that? Number two. That's Very number two. Okay. Good Correct. job. Okay, number Next. Number three, what should be on the healthy basket? Is it fruit juice or soda? Teacher? Uh, let's call um, Keisha. Fruit juice number one. Very good. Very good. Number one. Correct. Okay, next. Hmm. What should be on the basket? What should be on... Okay, what should be on the healthy basket? Sorry, let's have this. Okay. Let's call Ricky. Or that's Ryan. Hi, Ryan. I'm so sorry, Ryan. Yeah, that's Hello, Ryan. Ryan. Are you there? Okay. Hi. Turn on your microphone. What should be, what should be on the healthy basket, Ryan? Is it milk or coffee? <laughs> Meal. Very good. Which number? One. Very good. Number one. Very good. Correct. Next. Next. Okay. Which Next should be on the healthy basket. Yeah. How about miles? Let's call miles. Number okay. Two. What's that? What's on the number two? Corn. Okay, corn. All right. And this will be the last teacher. And let's call um, Summer and Jana. What do you prefer? Eggs or chocolate? Yeah. Eggs. 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 <laughs> Very good. Okay. Oh, there's still one more. Sorry, there's still one more. Can I have... Teacher, can I have um, Sheldon? Yes, Sheldon, yes. Sheldon, this is for you. What's what that? do you prefer, Sheldon? What do you choose? <laughs> Number? What number? Number. What number? Uh, so number. What's, what's, number. Number. what's on the number two? What's the number? Two. Lemon. 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 Oh, very good. Very good. Good. good job. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, um, that's our lesson about healthy eating habits. So I hope that you get something from our lesson from science and the language integration. And now the most awaited part of this um, trial class. <laughs> What's the next ice. part of this trial class? What do you think, guys? Ice. It's the? Ice. Okay, art. it's the art class. Yes. I know that you've been waiting ice. for this art class. <laughs> All right. So, um... 
Yes, I wanna I wanna call my partner again, Teacher Bongi, for his um art session. Teacher, okay. it okay. is now yours. Thank you, Teacher I. And hello, everybody. Yeah. Thank you, Teacher I. And hello, everybody. And today <laughs> is our art class, and I will teach you how to draw vegetable I'm and outside. roots. Okay. And after we draw the vegetable and fruits, we are going to paint it through the through pointillism art. Okay, so what is pointillism? We are going to use uh, dots in our when we color our fruits and vegetables. But first, we need to draw a plate in our uh, sketchbook or um, bond paper. Okay, so the materials that we need are, we need band paper or sketchbook if you have. And aside from sketchbook, we need marker. Marker. And we need um, watercolor. Watercolor. Very good. Aside from watercolor, we need a water too. Yeah, and very good. And, of course, we need a Q-tip. Where is your Q-tip? Good job. Okay. So, the title of our artwork is Healthy Plate Art. Okay. So, first, we are going to draw a plate. Okay. So, what's the shape of our plate? It's... Circle. Round. Round. Very good. Round. Very good. So let's draw a big circle. There you go. Just wait for a while. I'll just fix my... Okay. Okay, teacher, there it is. Man? Yes. Okay, thank you, teacher. Yeah. Okay. So first, I am going to draw a big circle. Don't worry, guys. Uh, uh, it's okay if it's not too perfect. That's all right. As long as it is circle. So let's draw a big circle. You can use a pencil first. Okay. You can use a pencil first. There you are. There okay. <laughs> this is my plate. Okay. And then There you go. This is my plate. Okay. And in our plate, uh, it sh we should have our healthy foods. Based on uh, Teacher I's uh, discussion, what are the foods that we need to make us healthy? We need what? Vegetables. What, what and are fruits. Vegetables? And fruits. What, uh, what are those Vegetables and fruits. We orange. need orange. Vegetables. Papaya. Papaya. Wow. 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 Good job. Banana, tomato, broccoli, strawberry, strawberry, wow. blueberry, apples, apples. Correct. How about meat? Do we need meat? No. Meat? <laughs> Meat. Do we need meat? Yes. yes. We need meat. Okay. Meat gives us, give us protein. And aside from vegetable foods, meat, we also need bread and greens for lunch. And that will be our artwork for today. So first, I am going to uh, divide it in half. Just like this. And 
another half. Just like this. I divide it in on a half. I divide it on three, actually. So I divide it first in half, then the other one I divide it in half too. So I have uh, three halves overall. Okay. And then let's draw fruits and vegetable in this area. So let's draw a uh, broccoli. So I use a pencil first. Can I draw anything? You can. There you go. This is my broccoli. It's, broccoli. Uh, it's actually like a, tree, like a tree, but it's a broccoli. Yes, it's, it's like a tree. It's like a mini tree. Yeah. <laughs> yes. yes, very good. Okay, you can copy my drawing. And aside from broccoli, let's eat. Um, I love. How about eggplant? Let's draw an eggplant. Oh. Mm. Yes, uh, yes, summer. <laughs> oh, let's draw an eggplant. So, as simple as that. First, I draw a long oblong or oval. <laughs> and there's a stem at the top and a leaf. Okay. So I have now my broccoli. Nag-overlap? Nag-overlap po eggplanting yung si dalawa. Yes. Sa dalawang plate. Yes. But that's fine. It's all right. It's okay. So broccoli, eggplant, and how about banana? Do you love banana? Yeah. Yes, yes, let's draw a banana. So how to draw a banana? Just like this. Yes, a banana is almost like an okra. Uh. But, <laughs> but it's much thicker than an okra. Correct. Very good. Oh, wow, my banana looks weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I have now my banana. Okay. And let's draw a tomato. Tomato is very easy. Oh. First, let's draw a big circle or just circle. Just like that. And then there's the leaf on the top or the stem. Tomato. Tomato. And the last one, let's draw a carrot. Let's draw a carrot. <laughs> They've been laughing on their work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the important is you enjoy your artwork yeah yes, it doesn't need to look good at, as long as it looks like it really looks like it's a vegetable <laughs> <laughs> and now let i draw a carrot and now it's time for me to use my marker and just uh, uh make sure the line is uh clear Air, what do you think? <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> wow. wow. Okay. Yeah, that's great. Okay. Does everybody follow? 
Oh, yes, I think. Oh, look at Sheldon's work. <laughs> later, uh, later we'll put you on spotlight so that your your uh, your classmates will be able to see your work. Oh, I just love this uh, this group teacher. They're so focused and um, yeah. And also hardworking. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And next, so I have now my vegetable and vegetables and fruits. And now let's have what should be what should be the food inside in our plate. We need. We also need the proteins Ooh. and also the carbohydrates. We also need the proteins, carbohydrates, and also the food. Yeah. Very, Very good. Good, good no. job. So let's draw on the protein side. What are the protein food? Lots of meat and other things. Of course, <laughs> like eggs too. Correct. Eggs. Good eggs. job. Okay, Correct. let's draw an egg. Okay. It's sunny side up. <laughs> well, you could also make make it boiled. Make, boiled. Make your, make yeah. Make your, uh, your drawing of the egg boiled, too. Yes. <laughs> You're fine. Good job. And fish. Let's draw a fish. Yay. <laughs> go summer go jana wow i can see sheldon's work also how about oh i can see miles and ryan they are so um serious <laughs> doing their work all of us are serious and drawing our work yeah i know that you're enjoying guys i know <laughs> Enjoy your work. Focus on your work. Mm. Oh, fish. fish. Maybe we should also draw some okra. Yeah, you put some okra on your work. <laughs> egg, Mona. Egg, egg. and fish. Like and this. also a meat. We need meat too. Okay. So let's draw a meat. So if you're done, you should just wait for the others. And when Correct. all of the others are also done, should we also now color it? Yes, yes. we'll wait for it's your fun. teacher. Yeah. Let's just wait for your teacher's instruction. All right. There you go. And I have now my meat. <laughs> to draw a meat, just draw a... Uh, this kind of shape. Oh, I yeah. You just manipulate your circle, just like this. Look at mine. It's <laughs> like um, it's like a raindrop something. Oh, that's your work, Davin. Okay. Very yeah. detailed, all right. Yeah, we'll we'll put you on spotlight later. I mean, all of you, each one of you, will put you on spotlight. Okay. And right. for the carbohydrates, okay. And for oh, the there you are. Oh. And also, maybe we're when we're now done coloring, we should maybe also take a picture of this. Yes, we will. Well, later, after we, this one. We're not yet done. Yes, oh, yes, <laughs> yes. We will. <laughs> we will wait. <laughs> Don't worry. Yeah, we'll wait for everybody. Don't worry. So. Okay, there you are. Okay, and next one. In this side, I will draw a bread. So how to draw a bread? So first I make a curved line, just like that. And then... Just uh, you are going to make a square line down, just like that. 
Ice. Wow, cute work. Then. Here you What? Straight line like this. Curve line. Then connect. That is my bread. Okay. How's everybody? Are you done with in uh, what <laughs> food are you now? Yeah, they're I almost done. With all of my food. With all of the food. No. Oh. Yeah, Let's majority go. of our students teacher they're uh, they're doing their face just just like what you're uh, just like how you do it. Wow. They they tend to follow you, yeah. Very good. Okay, thank you, teacher. I <laughs> yeah. and, uh, yes, teacher. No, no, no. Okay. After the uh, after the bread, we are going to draw a rice. Can you draw a rice? Oh! Rice, 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 rice. Rice in the cup. Yeah, so, rice in a cup, rice in a bowl. <laughs> rice. Of course, we should also never forget rice because rice is the... It's the food that we add for every meal. Very good. Perfect. Hello, teacher. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Sariki. Hello. You guys are all watching together. Do you want to see? Oh, dear. That's what they're doing right now. They're doing all right. Let me put you on spotlight. All right. I want to say hello to La Union. Teacher, you say hello to La Union. <laughs> hello to La Union. Hi. Hello. Hello. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Thank you. I know we know that you uh that the kids are enjoying their work. I know. <laughs> Okay, and I'll just erase my pencil, my pencil lines. Okay. Let me see if you're done. Tell me if you're done. If you are done with your drawing. I'm also done. You're all okay. Done. Yay. Okay. Yeah. I'll remove you on spotlight for a while, teacher. And then I want you to see the work of our kids. Yes, teacher. Yeah. There they are. I would like to check Kisha's artwork. Okay. Just, just uh, show your work. Wow, very good. Good job. Okay. okay. How about, oh, it's Summer and Jana. Hi, Summer and Jana. Wow, that's nice. Uh, you have a healthy food right there. Very good. And also Sheldon. Hi, Sheldon. Hi, Sheldon. Wow. There you are. Wow. Very good. I like your drawing. And how about and also Jemsen. Hi Jemsen. Yeah, Jemsen. Get finished. Okay. How about Miles, teacher? Uh, yes, let's call Miles. Uh, oh, wow. there it is. There you go. And Davin. Hi, Davin. Ah, no, it's a full plate. Yes, I took up all of the full. <laughs> wow, yeah. good job. How about Ryan? And Ryan, hi, Ryan. Oh, all right. 
Correct. Oh. Yeah. Oh, very good. Finish. Oh. Good job. May hindi pa ba tayo natawag, teacher? O lahat na tawag? Hmm, lahat na. We're able ah, to call see. everybody. Thank you, teacher. So, okay. So, may iba pang hindi pa tapos eh. Okay, pero okay lang yan. So, this time, we will going to uh, color it using our watercolor water and a cutie. That's what we do. <laughs> I also have my cotton bud. <laughs> there they are. I also okay. have my cotton bud. Yes, very good. Just finish first your uh drawing, then tell me if you're finished. Then we are going to color it using our. So we will do the point. Well, you're going to color it using your Q tip or your paintbrush. Yes, Q tip. We'll be using your Q tip. All right. We'll our Q tip. Okay. okay. So first, let's put um water inside the water bottle. Okay. So I will using my spray. Yeah, you see my spray. I will wet it. Okay. Um, let's uh, kids uh, listen carefully, and I want you to uh, I want you to look closely on what your teacher will be doing, so that you'll be able to make your work correctly. All right. Yes. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, I'm wait wetting all of the paint with my paintbrush. We'll be using your Q-tip. All right. First, I'll wet it first. All my watercolor. Yeah. This is my watercolor. And then, using my Q-tip. Okay. I will color my broccoli. What's the color of the broccoli? It's color? Green. 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 Very, very good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, so, using my tip, I'll put some dot. Uh, okay. Inside you color in dots. Yeah. You color in dots. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that. Okay. Are you enjoying your work, Summer and Jana? Yes. So, nawala yung antok ni Summer. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. Yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll start to put you on spotlight, kids. I'll start to put one by one on spotlight so that your classmates will also see you. Uh, okay, we have, let's put Summer and Jana on spotlight. There you are. Okay, you're on the big screen, girls. <laughs> Hi. All right. Wow, you're so busy. <laughs> and the color of the leaves are green. Okay. Next, I'll put Jemsen on spotlight. 
Hi, Ate. <laughs> Busy. Okay. Next, let's have Davin. Oh, look at Davin's work. Yeah. <laughs> there you are. Okay. Next, I'll feature Sheldon. Busy. <laughs> Sheldon is so busy. Sheldon, you're in the big screen. Hi. <laughs> yes, you show your work. Yeah, you show your work, Kuya. Very good. Okay, thank you for that. Next, I'll put Keisha. Oh, Keisha is on the big screen now. Hi. And Hello. I will color my carrots with color orange. Okay, there you are. Teacher, you're on the big screen now. <laughs> yes, I'll put uh -huh, Miles. Wow. Okay, there you are. And then... <laughs> Let's have Ryan. Hi, Ryan. How's your work? How was it? Okay. Ryan is busy. <laughs> And the color of my tomato is color red. Oh, color red. Oh, there you are. I start at the uh, sides. Yeah. Uh, tomato. Your teacher is doing the outline. And the color of my eggplant is color violet. I love color violet. That's my favorite color. For me, my favorite color is blue. Ah, okay. And the color of the banana, yellow and color white. Yeah. 
Okay. Are you done with fruits and vegetables? Not yet. Not yet. Okay. Yeah. We will wait you. Yes, I want to pop up. I the next one. Let's color my uh, fish color brown because what's the color of the tilapia? Fried tilapia. <laughs> it's color brown. Brown. <laughs> Very good. Just using a dot, using your Q-tip. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay. Everybody's busy. <laughs> and next one, uh -huh. color red because that's the color of the meat. Tomatoes. <laughs> There you go. And the color of the skin of the pig is pinkish white. There you go. And for my egg yolk, it's color yellow. Egg yolk. That, 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 and... <laughs> okay. And the color of the egg white is white. Only white. And the color of my uh, bowl is color. My favorite color is color blue. McDavid. Oh, maybe I need to wash 
Color of my rice is color white. Okay, this, this one. This, how this one? Oh, oh, oh. Let's put some dots. <laughs> 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 okay. Okay. Uh, help me, guys. What's the color of the bread? It's color. It's color brown, I think. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's color brown. Okay. It's color color brown. What? Okay, done. Wow, somebody's done now. Done. Tada! Champion po done na po. Wow. Oh, wow. Tada! Good job. Okay. Let's just wait for the others. Uh, wow, almost everyone. Yeah, they're done doing their work. Ngaling. <laughs> All right, I will put you on gallery. There you are. Okay, maybe it's time to exhibit your artwork. Your obra maestra. <laughs> okay, there you are. Let me see your oh. obra. Oh. This is my artwork. My favorite food here is uh, eggplant. Eggplant and fish. And also broccoli. <laughs> that is my favorite food. Okay. Oh. Summer, tell me what's your favorite food? Yeah, I'll put them on spotlight. Tell the truth. It's all fresh, fish, broccoli, and carrot. Wow. Well, I like orange about, and apple. How about Jana? How about Jana? Let's call Jana then. Apple. Louder, Anata, louder. <laughs> Broccoli. Apple. Wow, you have an apple. Red. 
<laughs> okay. Very good summer. Very good, Jana. You did a good job. Okay. So, Teacher okay. Ari, who do you want to call? Yeah, I think we should call Davin now. Davin? No. Okay. Yes. Uh, well, I like oranges and apples. I also like bananas. Well, it depends on it looks kind of weird. <laughs> okay. And so you love fruits. The I apples, love... orange, yes. and banana. Yes. All those food are... And these fruits. are the eggs. Well, this is the egg, which is the whole sunny side oh. world and another sunny side egg. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, this is meat. Meat. Mm -hmm. Fresh meat. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you Very so much, good. David. All right. Okay. Uh, let's call Sheldon. I'll put Sheldon. Sheldon is so excited. <laughs> Sheldon, tell us about your artwork. Uh -huh. What's that? Fish. Oh. Wow. What's your favorite? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> wow. Oh, Good job. <laughs> Look at this boy. Okay. Next teacher, I would like to call Keisha. Keisha. Keisha, it's your turn. Tell us about your artwork. Well, what's your favorite food right here? My favorite food in, food in my artwork is banana. Mm -hmm. That's a banana? Yes. Okay. Good job. And, okay. What else? And banana egg. Or, and egg. egg. Red. Bread, okay. carrot, oh. fish. Oh, there you are. Thank you so much, Keisha. Okay, let's have uh, Miles. Oh, I'll put you on spotlight, Miles. Oh, tell us about your artwork. What's your favorite there? Banana. 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 Okay. What else? Banana only? Aside from aside from banana, do you have any favorite uh, food? Egg. Egg. And that's it. Okay. okay. Very good, Miles. Good job. All okay. right. Teacher, let me call Ryan. Ryan, are you okay? Are you there? There you are. Okay. <laughs> Hi. Ryan, hello. Ryan, Ryan it's, it's your turn. Oh, okay. So tell me yeah. about your artwork. What's your favorite food? Banana. Banana. <laughs> okay. Banana. What else? Aside from banana, what do you love to eat? Banana bread, what else? And fish. Yeah, you can point it. Please point your drawing. What else? You can do it with Ryan, 
Oh, what's that? That's a... What's that? A carrot. No, that's not a carrot. Um, oh, I'm trying um, to... Yeah, that's me. Correct. Yeah. All right. Okay. Thank you so much. Yes. Um, this... Uh, do you know that... Um, this my plate is uh, the ideal, the ideal set of foods that kids should take in their early years. Do you know that, kids? Yes. Okay. Thank you so much. All right. Next to Ryan, let's have Jem said. Thank you, Ryan. Hi, Jemson. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. Oh. Uh -huh. Okay. Wow. <laughs> yeah. So tell us about your artwork. Um, what do you like in your uh, plate? All of this feature because this is healthy. Yes, oh. very good. Good job. And you love most, of course. Do you have any specific food that you love? Broccoli. Broccoli. Okay. Broccoli and chicken. All right. I think I think we've already uh yeah, I think we've already mentioned everyone in this uh art session. Can we have a group photo of your work. <laughs> okay, everybody, let, show me your artwork and let's take a picture. Yeah, let's take a picture, everyone. All right, ready? Only teacher Ai doesn't have a work. <laughs> ready? One, two, three, smile. Okay, there you are. Thank you so much, teacher. I got it now. Okay. All right. Yes. So, since this is uh, a part of our um, healthy eating habits um, activity, you can share your work on, on, on your uh, social media accounts. And then you can use our hashtag, hashtag never stop learning at RWC. Okay, you can take a picture and then post it on your Facebook or Instagram and then use our hashtag. All right, teachers. So to wrap up this, we're done with the show and tell and i want to give our kids a big 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 round of applause all right kids thank you for doing such a great job for this afternoon all right we've seen everybody we've seen your hard work today and we really appreciate all of your uh, creative work Okay, just a quick riff, uh, since uh, Teacher is also our Supervisor for Academic Affairs, he will be giving some um, updates about our, the, the center profile, or I mean the, the programs that our center cover at this point of time. So teacher, what are those programs? What are the special classes that we offer at this moment? Okay, okay, everyone, everyone here in here RWC, in RWC the offered programs that we have are we have art camp for kids. Okay, so if you want to join in our art class, uh, don't hesitate to um, um, to join with us in our art in our art yeah. class. You can message us in our YouTube channel Facebook. or yeah, Facebook, Facebook page. yeah, Facebook page, and we will uh, cater you guys. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. So that uh, work is 2,500 pesos. Good for 10 sessions. All yeah. right. Next program, so, please. And the next program, we have reading readiness and remediation. Uh, this uh, program is good for uh, three, four, and five years old. Good for three to four years old, actually. Yes. yes, and for for students who also have difficulties 
dealing with their uh, with with their reading skills. Yeah, uh, uh, this program uh, worth two thousand five hundred pesos and good for ten sessions. Yes. Okay. Aside from that, we also have matching where we can coach you on how to solve uh, problems and yes. dealing with numbers, okay? So uh, the worth of that program is 3,000 pesos. Good, uh, th that is a one-on-one -on -one session, one-on-one -on -one class and good for 10 sessions. So 3,000, but if you have classmates, it can be group of three children or three kids, the worth is 2,500 pesos only. Good for yes. 10 sessions. Exactly. Yeah. And there is also an, an update about this Mad Gym teacher, right? We'll, we will be, uh, we will start accepting high school students for this Mad Gym program. So uh, we can have high school students like grade seven and up if they have difficulties with math. All right. Yes. Thank you, teacher. And aside from Mad Gym, we also have homework assistance program. Okay, the worth of this program is 3,000 pesos only and good for 10 sessions where you can, we can help you with any subjects that Correct. you have. Okay, so if you have difficulties in Filipino, in English, or in math, or in Araling Panlipunan, or social studies, we can cater that. Okay. All right. Okay, next. Oh, these are the special programs that we have. Okay, speaking of speaking of special program, our curriculum is aligned in what we call 21st century skills. That's why we have coding for kids. Right. Yeah. Coding for kids and ESL, English language, English as second language. Okay, most of our students here in ESL is actually a uh, Korean. They yeah, are they are Koreans. And Korean. We also offer this in our in Filipino community. Yeah. And other <laughs> nations too. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh yes. Exactly. Aside from no, so this way, is powered by Epic. Yes, this is powered by Epic, Devin. That's correct. Yes. Epic actually. What is Epic teacher? By the way, thank you, Devin, for reminding us. What is Epic teacher? Uh, we in RWC we have our own library actually exactly. where you can read any books that you like unlimited books okay uh, as may, uh, you can read may, uh, many books as you can okay so as long, and that's as for you as long as you are um, uh, what you call this um, teacher connected yeah as long as you have that epic account connected with RWC. Yes, that uh, the worth of this program, ESL class, is 3,000 pesos and good for 12 sessions. This exactly. is a one-on-one -on -one class. Okay. Correct. And aside from ESL, we have coding for kids, for those yeah. kids who wants to learn coding or knowledge about computer, computer science, science. Uh, teacher? Yeah. Teacher? Yes. Ayan, Sorry, okay. my screen got. Mm -hmm. The worth of this program is 5,000 pesos. Don't worry because we have two courses here, actually. You can choose one. Uh, we have Google CS1. In Google CS1, we have Google Logo and Art by CS First. Okay, digital art, actually, by CS First. And in Google CS2, we have interactive presentation and game design. Exactly. Correct. Game design. That's very interesting. So each course uh, is, is worth 5,000 pesos. Right, teacher? I? Yes, and correct. The, and after, once you finish our um, program or this course, uh, Google will give you a certificate. This is exactly. inclusive of a Google certificate. Correct. Yeah. Okay. So okay. that's uh, that would be all, and I hope uh, you you will join us 
in our uh, programs. Correct. Indeed, teacher, I agree with you. And to formally end our program, just like what we have uh, been saying to you since the start of our program, you can share this live stream via Facebook. And after we have uploaded this video on YouTube, you can also share the link and post it on your social media accounts. Again, our uh, center, um, the, our center accounts on YouTube would be a Read Write Count Tutorial Center. You can find us on YouTube. And you can also follow us on your Facebook accounts. And teacher, just like what we are always saying here in our center. Yes. Hashtag never stop learning at RWC. And thank you, everyone. Thank you so much, everybody. What would you like to say to our Facebook community and to our YouTube channel? Open your microphone, please. Well, I'll, well, this call is also fun. Oh, really? <laughs> Thank you so much. We, uh, we also enjoyed having you today in our tri fifth trial class. Stay tuned on our next program. And uh, we hope to see you again on our next sessions. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Questions, you can uh, you can stay on this link if you have questions and stop live stream.